The Royal Naval Stores Depot opened at Copernacre in 1942 at a cost of around £300,000, initially to house underwater sonar equipment underground. These old quarries provided a safe and stable environment for electronic stores and in 1945 another quarry was acquired and in 1955 another quarry had been obtained at Monks Park. By 1966 there was a transfer of headquarters staff from London, they were posted to Corsham. By this time the organisation was one of the largest government establishments in the country and it employed some 1,700 people both above and below ground. In 1991, the Secretary of State for Defence announced a reduction in submarine fleets. This would naturally reduce the need for supporting and supplying these vessels. Copernacre was to close by March 1997. Despite renewed efforts by many, the writing was on the wall. We haven't got our gloves. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> what do we reckon then, Steve? I'm just going to go wild, don't you, Matt? Matt, we've got an infrared camera. I don't know if you can see it. You can see it through our gloves. Look, look on my camera. Oh, I was just looking for the high voltage cables, but they're there. I thought it was like an electric fence for a minute. See it? What? The red light flashing light in front of us. Is that an infrared camera? No, no it's an alarm. There's two of them actually, I can see two of them flashing. See that white roof? Yeah, yeah. Look, just look, can you see it? Just yeah. see the right of it? Yeah. It's an alarm. That's yeah. right. It's on. You can see it straight ahead. Ready? Like every four seconds. Yeah. Well, when we get in, we're walking in. See that there? That's a hundred foot drop, that is. That's the, that's the bend. All those are grills on the side. Mm -hmm. There goes Matt. easier than a fork. So we're, we're entering the bunker area now, like Matt's just said. If the alarms go off, we stay filming. We go further in. Don't panic, don't run. So yeah, guys, let's have a look. There's alarms. I've got 
day torch. Big torch? Yeah, it's a through night. Big enough to film with? Yeah. Yeah, it's a nice big time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Hmm? You say this is the style? Yeah. So we're not gonna know if we've set it off anyway. Lift your foot up, lift your foot up. That's it. Turbo mode on. The thing is, we could climb. We could climb down there. So I think we have just. I think we got to climb back around and go under this thing. Really? Go back around and go under it. Yeah. Don't, do not do that. Oh, right, we're all down and we've got a climb. Down here, I guess, man. Yeah. Oh, you had to say it, Steve. Right, I can't see a thing. Should we start doing that? Sorry. Matt, he's forgot his torch today. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, look at these wheels are on. So, 
Hopefully those brakes work. Ah, this is extreme. Look at this, guys. So that is where we're going. You alright? Yeah. Well, I don't know whether there's a lighting or not, but we just wouldn't play there for Okay. So how can there's lights on down here, Matt? Because there is power to the whole place, you know. Yeah, but if you say they're live, I wouldn't piss about. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing on them. Right? Hopefully, he's here. There's guys up there. <sighs> that is some scale. Are going to climb off the back of that? No. Wow. Holy moly. Yeah. Let's have a look how they're getting on. They've got a way to go yet. Wow, look at this, guys. So I think Matt's looking out for alarms. Okay, that sounds promising. No, I... What? Well, that's one, isn't it? Oh, I thought it was a similar setup to... Uh... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, so we've got to climb up here. Uh, let's just put my glass on. All right, this should be fun. You have to buy sensors again. No, I don't think that's one. Oh, that that's an alarm, though, isn't it, Matt? This one. Hasn't triggered. You're right, but it hasn't triggered. There's nothing on the other side there. Yeah, there is it doesn't have a reciprocal one on the other side. Oh, yeah. Unless it's a mirror over there. But if it was if it triggered, I think all the lights would come on, don't you? Because it's an emergency system. When when triggered, all the lights come on. Okay. For safety, you know? Yeah. Oh, to avoid it anyway. So you must have triggered it as well. I, I just didn't trigger it. Yeah. So did Jordan look? Jordan's just triggered it. Well, I've seen as exactly the chicken. I was doing it all crystal maze. So yeah, guys, that is the alarm. 
As you'll see, if Steve triggers it. Straight in front of your knee. Okay. Yeah, it's just triggered. What again? And look. Yeah, it's just been definitely totally triggered, so just go through it. Yeah. They even know we're in Europe, they just don't care. Well, if it's only just gone off. Wow. They're not going to have enough time to respond, are they? Guys, look at this. Look at this, guys, look. Wow. So what is through there? Hopefully no. Oh wow. Look at this. The bunker is now open. Matt has activated the bunker. Wow. Yeah, Jordan's playground now. So there you go, easy access, Steve. Oh, I thought he's going under it then. <laughs> So Steve exploring within, Yo guys. got Matt's secret vault with us today, yeah. well for actually showing us this, thanks Matt. And obviously on the controls we've got B-Face Computing. The conduit's down here. That? Yeah look where it lights used to be. Oh, yeah. I bet it won't like that before. So look at all this carved out. Well, we're in too deep now, Steve. Well, exactly, unless they just work that thing we were stood on top of. So all this space, what's it being used for at the minute? This is madness, mate. Look how far it goes, guys. <laughs> Toilets, do you reckon, Steve? Oh, oh it might be a shaft or something. Right, it's an empty room. It's only me, but I Maybe do that one more well. Yeah. So you did say, Matt, yeah. when if we set the alarms off, the lights will go on. Yes, yeah, they're already on. Oh. Just a couple of lights. But oh. we don't know if these are already some on. Some of, them, some of them are on, I suppose, but yeah. Amplifying. This is to speak to people on the services, like mine equipment, mine safety equipment, but amplifying it. Why does it say find space? It's locked. Oh, we've got a locked door. Mm. So people have been here. There's another one here, Matt, look, but it's been. Oh, it's got a very there, haven't it? Yeah. Locked. What's that? I'll move that back. Yeah. There's a lot of power coming into this room. Oh, mm, it's after a bit you. old, isn't it? Look, the air conditioning control there. Yeah. My brake is locked. A bit air conditioning, that, isn't it? Oh wow. Did it 
still operational after all. Oh, yeah, it's definitely operational. You can just, you can go to see aircraft and then quick now, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, if you got it and plugged it into the equipment. Yeah. It's just got on the side, eBay box. eBay box, so they're selling all this off. Like. Is that mod zero or MOD zero? We're selling it on eBay? Yeah, look, if you come around here. Look. Mm. That's the uh, eBay box supply drop. Right, warning radiation risk, category 5, sealed sources. Then there's any radiation left in there? I don't know, do you want to put your head in it? Let's <laughs> see if you lose your hair. <laughs> oh, my gimbal's gone. Uh, it just keeps going and going. Fuck. What? Mag box room. Mag box. We're not actually that deep on the ground, are we? No. So we're only maybe 40, 50 feet. Yeah. A lot, really. It's probably Bloody. just a bit lower than the stuff all the shows we were in. Yeah, yeah, you're getting on for that, yeah. You can feel the humidity, though. Yeah. Down there, dead end, but yeah, what's in these boxes? Look, like? oh, yeah. warning contains asbestos, asbestos, yeah. asbestos. Free Bentos? Yeah, Free Bentos. Yeah. It's the one. Are you doing that? And then they tell you it's unhealthy for now. Free Bentos. What's wrong with it? I don't know. Full of asbestos. That's <laughs> <laughs> everywhere now. Alco seal. Alco seal. I don't know. Be careful, some of that might be nasty smelling. It's an old smell. Protein, 6%. Yeah, it's going to. Suitable for hydrocarbon fuel fires. No, no, that's how we open them. But it says Angus Fire over there. Angus Fire. So it's something to do with fire retardancy or something, probably. See, we're wise on that, not. I don't know how well, but. Yeah, because you just don't know. Yeah, I'll open it tight, then I'll open it. Would you open that, Alex? No. Not for a chocolate biscuit. I wouldn't even risk that for a biscuit, mate. Oh yeah, that's a good point, mate, yeah. Troy Sponder. Hey. Oh Jesus, it is as well. Yeah, completely asbestos lined roofs. Oh, okay. Well as long as we don't disturb it, mate. It's all over the place, isn't it? Yeah. It's literally everywhere. Fourth Avenue. Fourth Avenue? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where did they go? Because the voice voices the travel, don't they? Yeah. Do you think you'd get lost in this, Steve? Yeah. If we weren't with Matt? <laughs> There's uh, Jordan. Well, you've got a wire problem, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I can see what secrets lie within the junction boxes on the wall. There's been a crash there. Yeah. Do you reckon they crashed the forklift? Well, yeah, look, you can ah, see the tyre tracks. Yeah. You can actually. Yeah. So let's follow it and let's do a. Uh... Crash the forklift. Yeah. 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 Y
There's no tyre marks that lead into that. No, no tyre marks, but no big gash. Although you can. You can see something's gone into that. Everybody be quiet. It's more constant in it then. Yeah. Well, <coughs> ladies and gentlemen, I am not fucking filming now. I don't, I don't, I, what's going on with me tonight? <laughs> Matt's having a mare. No torch. Is it like stopping filming after so many minutes? Or oh, 10 minutes? Just keep it on. It stops recording after 10 minutes. Mine that from the so that's a little walkway. Either way. Sounds like you were. That's delicious, Alex. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to borrow your footage to fill in the blanks of where yeah. the bloody camera's not even filming. Every ten minutes, it'll stop and start it. Now it's crazy. Yeah, this could be interesting. Oh yeah. If we could get it open, because it might lead you to some sort of like service deep. Channel. No, you know, I don't think, I don't think anyone else would come down here or look, look down there. All the concrete There we go, guys. That's all we've got down there. Worth a look, though, isn't it? Yeah, well done. Right. Let's get this back down, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. PSA. Oh, they're in here. I thought I could hear them through. Santa's Grotto, eh? What the hell? I'm not kidding, actually. No. Is that salt? Or? Yeah, it's like a crystal Have you seen like this? mineral. Santa's Grotto. Santa's Grotto. It's like a, min a mineral. Oh, do you know what? That could be leading directly to the other. To the other mine. To the coal mine, can we get into it tonight? It's the next mine along, yeah. That looks like an access way, doesn't it? Yeah, it does, yeah. But watch out, there's a big drop there. Oh, shit. It's only full of water, so I... Do you want me to have a look up there, or do you think that's well, probably not worth it? Well, you're quite pleased. Do you want to do it? Yeah. I'll leave my bag here, it might be easier. Okay. I think it's funny, that's good. Have you been into Santa's Quarter? Oh, there's a salt pit there. Yeah, I did so, yeah. Well, how would we tackle this? It's quite a drop. Put back, put back into the left, seeing the leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my god, look at the ceiling. There's no leaf in here, is there? There's no, it's no what? Could be a wind tunnel, you know, could be an air, air vent tunnel. Well, we're about to find out. It is a dead end. Dead end. It's literally a wall. Mm. But, yeah, it is a dead end. Oh. Still quite cool, though. Isn't it? Yeah. Is it a dead end as in they... No, it's, it's a dead end as in they've cut it out. Yeah. And that's it, they've just cut this into a square. And it doesn't go anywhere, it's no, it's no brickwork. No, no brickwork at all. Just solid rock. All right, well, nice one, mate. See you <laughs> See what I have to put up with, guys. <laughs> what for? Them. Really? Um, yeah, so they used to do like the submarine equipment testing. So that must have been a deep yeah. 
deep bath. I mean, we don't, we never really know what's happened there. Nice. See yeah. mm. you. See, notice there's no graffiti down here whatsoever. <laughs> Until we put our stickers here, Steve. It's nice and original for us. Yeah, this is... We don't want to go exploring and see graffiti and... No. It is actually, yeah, good to be like one of the first people in it. Exploration and finding the uh, clean stuff. Now there's a pink emergency escape room somewhere in here. I'll show it to you when we get to it. It's that noise again. Yeah. I think it's just the electric. A generator or something. See, this is an original door here, look. For emergency, break glass. So this was highly secure at one point because that fencing goes right to the ceiling yeah. and it's completely blocked off and yet here we are. This was probably quite secure at one point. Yeah, I just wonder what was in here mate. Because you've got the tracks again on the floor coming yeah, straight in. Time, there's nothing really here is there to stop you? I think because there's another fence there. Yeah, yeah, there's probably something on this one. Yeah. I mean, the fact that there's no cameras in here either, you'd have thought that would have been closely monitored if there was stuff like that yeah, going on. It's probably so secure. Oh. What? Oh, that's not a sensor, is it? I thought that It looks quite new as well. Yeah. Loud. It's gonna be just the. Oh. I'm open, so Steve. Yeah. Yeah. It's flashing already, Matt. No, no, that's okay. That's no, it's not. That's the sensor. Yeah, it went red when you two went past it. Motion sensor there, look. Really? Yeah. yeah it's just flashed. Wow. Hey, you've got a pipe. Yeah. yeah. Motion sensor. So it's not flashing now, but it was when you walked past it. Yeah, it's it. definitely moving. <laughs> and that's... That fire was flashing. Right above your head now, that one. Yeah, there it yeah, goes it again. Yeah, there, look. This is the other one. It's got him. So I guess we just ignore that one then. <laughs> there you go, it's gone off again. There's another sensor there on the wall. Fuck hell, why is this so secure? Oh, what's this? It's the same everywhere. Leefield crew. The end begins. So this was decommissioned starting in 2014. Copenhagen outload. Copenhagen. 2016 coffin. Yeah, we have to have the emergency exit. Yeah, where is it? Yeah, over here. Well, the nurse is set and done. Okay, so have a look. That was an emergency exit to the um, the quarry. So it goes in into the white up there, and then the quarry carries on. Ah, right. Hey, look at this. So we've had the lamps. Hey. All those lots are on there. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Equipment for emergency use only as well. Yeah, Key for torch boxes. Matt could have done with one of them. Oh. Well. Why were we? Remember, go under. Yeah, that's great. It's the CU. It's got a sensor underneath as well, look. Ah, bollocks to it. Yeah, I noticed that. Behind you. Oh, there's another one there, look. 
I mean, we're just here to look around the document, cause any trouble. No. It's not here, see it? The old bell up there. E bomb bell. Yeah, that's the mini one. So at the minute guys, we've, um, we're just going to keep rolling the film. We've definitely set the um, sensors off, so we'll probably expect some uh, company at the top. So yeah, keep rolling and see what happens. Oh, it's another one there, look. That's just that. Yep. Good. <laughs> it's full of them down here. I didn't think there was any down here. Yeah. There's, there's uh, double doors there, and it goes through again, and that's when we were walking up the other side, so it's like the other major main road. Alright, don't go too far, Max, we'll get lost, mate. And that there is where we first came in, where those black plastic sheets are. And this is relatively new breeze block. Oh, yeah. So what's... Yeah. Lights in there. Did you hear that? I definitely heard something then. I don't know, mate. I definitely heard something then. No, it was like a, like something grinding. Hmm. Well, they're just shit temporary ones, aren't they? Um, this way, wasn't it? <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, no, we walked past that way. I think actually that's where we came in. Yeah. Which means that I... You see these old fire exams that resemble, do you? I think they're quite 60s. Yeah. Ah, oh, there's Jordan again with his... Oh, yeah, we've been in this way. So that sensor there didn't flash. Oh, that's a cool little bit. Oh, yeah. Wow, yeah. Hello, my name is Dennis. That is pretty cool, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah, cool. So through that way. Pedestrian access. So this would have been vehicular access. E bomb bell. <coughs> Something's leaking. Yeah, we didn't do this bit, did we? There's huge metal cages on this one. Yeah, oh, look at that. Yeah. Oh, all the electric pipes running in there and all. <coughs> look. Wow. It's like a natural sort of yeah. filtration system. Yeah. You better not get my phone too, well. That is lovely and... Oh. <laughs> it's hot, isn't it? I could uh, do with a dip right now. Oh, <laughs> well, that's that's a weird room, isn't it? Oh, um, yeah, but it's um. I don't know, just in the middle of the tunnel, yeah. built again. So that floor's very soft, but it's got original keys in there, look. What are these? Hey, look. We've got some safety lights. Oh, yeah. Shall I see if it still works? There's a couple more in there. Yeah. Ah, oh, there we go. Well, 
I don't think they're working anymore. Uh, That's a dud. Oh, I don't know. No, it, oh, that's my light on it. I was like, oh, it is working, look. <laughs> Who's that? I don't know. I'm guessing that's them. So. Let's see what they're doing, Steve. Oh my god, that's <laughs> super bad nice. Right. Look how rotten it is. Yeah, the top's hardly fixed. I mean it's literally so rotted. That's that noise, Steve. Yeah. You see pistons though it's like a shield. It's just a room. Awesome, that one. Yeah. It's all the storage for shite. Oh. <laughs> that whole joint's coming off, look. Like. I did. What's causing it to do that like that? Well, it's just the moisture. Yeah. Shall we just something around that? Oh, look at all that crap, man. There's um, loads of drifters along here, some of the new ones. That's probably the generator, isn't it? Yeah, just to keep these mm -hmm. lights on for nothing. What's in this door then? Danger, oh, right, it's substation, yeah. Yeah, a lot of crap in there, guys. It's interesting. Noisy, noisy. Oh, wow, there's another little stair and doorway up there in the distance. Use ear protectors. Oh, this is where the noise is coming from. Look at this. What the hell? Yeah. So Jordan shut them off. I mean, they're probably on for a reason. Yeah. Probably takes a while for them to kick in. Yeah, exactly. So, remote control, before working on this fan, the main isolator must be locked in position. Confined space. Wow. Yeah, look at these. Fans have started back up, I think. Those fans have started again. Yeah, look, it's starting up again. I think they are. Oh, that was not. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice. No. True, but it's nice. Look at the size of this. Wow. So these are going to be like little workshop rooms up here. 
serious leakage coming in from somewhere there. Fans back on. Yeah. So this is back through to where the fans are. Yeah, all on now. Yeah. Yeah, if you turn them off, they have to be physically restarted with the button. Have we been in this bit? No. Uh, we can just keep zigzagging through. Mate, I've lost me bearings. I've lost the side of it. It's all falling cabinets, isn't they? Or... <coughs> Ooh, shit. These are old crates. Oh, military. Look at them. Hey. Yeah. Oh yeah, Jesus. That is uh Few little relics left here and there. Look at that up there. Oh, where are we going now? So this is G13. Touch them just in case. Something you're not going to touch, Jordan. Oh, shit, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, that's it. So, some of this is just rotten. Look, that, that used to be some sort of office area, but that has just been completely gutted out. So all, all wooden frames. Like, um, some sort of special room. Look, secure doors. Yeah. Look at that. That's, that might just be a maintenance sort of area behind this. It's all rotten through now, then. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I thought they were buttons, they're not, they, they screw, they screw antennas in. That's an aerial patch bay. I wonder if this is it. Wow. 24 channels. So this had some serious kit going on in there. There's a lot of equipment beyond all of these walls. Oh, so the ceiling's got asbestos as well. It's those boards. Yep. TV. Where? Oh yeah. That's a mirror. So for forklifts coming round, so you could see round the corner. No, exactly, and they were all, yeah, and then they were waiting for us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you think Tom 
Obviously, there was a long Yeah. Yeah, I don't think they're worried about that so much now. Because you've got to think, if it, if it had sensitive stuff in, it would have on-premise security, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. So that building... That Um, what was I going to say, Steve? So that building where we first came in with the travelator that goes down, at one point that would have been well secure. Yeah. Proper secure. It's just a fair game now, I think. Is it really? Yeah. So you'd be alright then, Steve? Oh, yeah. Another secure unit there, look. Really? Oh yeah, breeze blocked up at the top. You are entering a working quarry area. Proceed with extreme caution until you reach the surface. <laughs> that would have been cool though. We could have had a bunker slash quarry explore. Yeah. So we're in H now, that's his H6 on that thing. We've just come from G. <laughs> that made a bit of a noise, didn't it? Yeah, that's fire siren. Hose has been removed though. Something flashing down there, I think. Is that? Sure, it's a red flash down there. Yeah. You see it? Uh, turn your light off. Where about in relation to Straight down. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So that's constant. Yeah. That's not triggered by us. I think this is the far end of the far end of it now. A yeah. Really? Yeah. So what shall we do if it's like if it would crack about about it? Straight down, straight ahead. Straight down, straight ahead. Really? God. Show me face. So what do you reckon then? You, you enjoying this? Absolutely crazy, Matt. Thanks you actually just making sure though, Matt. Are you actually filming? I am filming. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. My my buzzer's just gone on my watch. I'm going to start filming here now. Every. So, Matt, when what? When are we going to find the Men in Black and the Roswell aliens? <laughs> Does this one work? Is it open? Spin the thing out. I think yeah. they've unplugged it. Look, the motor's not working. Oh, yeah, they have unplugged it. Oh, my God. God. <laughs> Keeps on going, folks. Keeps on going. Ah, oh, look at this little room. I say, look at that little room. That's well lit. That's quite cool. Look at this. Alright, and that's where the secrets are down there. It is fucking boiling, mate. 
And look, because of the uh, asbestos, I've got my face mask on, got my hood up, got about three layers on because it was a little bit chilly outside and uh, I've been regretting it now. Oh, people, I reckon if they're driving down it, you'd drift, you'd drift around that, wouldn't you? Look at that, that's just perfect. I think the, um, the engine noise is down there as well. Yeah. Oh, that'd be cool. Right, so I'll turn the lights off, guys. Not like a boy racer type sound, like a proper supercar sound. <laughs> yeah. Boy racer type sound very nice. Look at that. So we have got working lights down here, which is pretty handy because my torch is super hot at the minute. Is that where we just were up there? It was a bit I don't remember those double doors at the top. No. Uh, I'm going to follow you, Steve. The problem is the sound travels so weirdly around these places. <laughs> Especially in the woods, Yeah, I can imagine that. Was that rumble? Did you hear that? I heard a rumble above. Yeah, a big rumble above. Fire exit here. I wonder if that's locked off. Yep, with us in it. It's open. No, it's not a spiral, it's another door. I'm just checking for sensors, but there's uh... I'll just turn the torch off. Flickery light. What's through this, Steve? Let me just... That's a weird little ring. That's the fire exit, yeah. Spiral? That's just a camera right. Can you do it? Come to it, yeah. Yeah. Is that blocked off at the top? We don't know, but it might be a way to get out. It's probably bricked up though, isn't it? I don't know, you can try it. Go <laughs> like, if, if we go this way, yeah. then it's probably out and we, we're gone, like, you know. Because, Have we done now, then, yeah? Well, we've done as much as I think we can do. Yeah. yeah. But the thing is, it's a different way out. Which is do you not want to go swimming in some pit? Yeah, you can. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try to film that. I think I'll waste some film on that. <laughs> oh my god, it's perfect. Like, woo, woo! Yeah, bear in mind, if there's somebody on the surface, you might be able to hear us. Yeah. Quiet. <laughs> Alright, let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. It's very wet up here. And look at this. We've literally just got rock carved out. Staircase carved right into the rock. Well, we better hope there's an exit up here because uh, it goes up a long way. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but Jordan's halfway up already. That goes a long way. You up for this, Matt? Yeah. Or do you want a piggyback? Is it? Oh, yeah. Got a light on up there. Ooh. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. The rock's getting a bit. I love how that looks really wet when you touch it, it's just bone dry. The thing is, because these stairs look like they've got all the salt and stuff on, yeah. we don't know how corroded they are. Yeah. They've been probably made of this material that is affected by the... Well, let's hope so. <laughs> yeah, please say we don't have to go back down again. We 
We're nearly at the top, guys. Two more flights. Yeah, standing in front of it. Ah, there it goes. It's Jordan up there. I was going to double call the top floor. We're out. Yeah, there's one. It's open. Oh, thank Christ. Didn't like that. Yeah, that alarm isn't active. Yeah, it's seen better days. A bit cobwebby. Oh, there's more. As soon as Matt mentions the lift of Jordan. Oh, no. Oh, that's a good lift. Good lift. Good lift. Very level surface level. And bear like your little legends. So after you then. What's up there? Do you have a... I get the feeling that I say to just go in the room and... Jump the climb out there. Turn it on. Do you have a new key? Oh yeah. Sure. A long key. key. I think the girl where we went, you know, when they took us down in that one somewhere. Oh, what? Huh? Oh, you want to take a look? Yeah, it was a modern lift. I got footage of you going down the lift. So you'll see the lift. How much did I think? Did you ask him? This was like donkeys years ago. Didn't even have the internet. When I came down here, you didn't even have the internet. Like, it was 20 odd years ago I came down here. It's a postcard size. It's a bit busy. A lot going on. I like how busy it is, I don't like it being, look at how simple, you can look at how simple that is, yeah. you know, has it got an NFC tag in it or something? No, it's just off the doors. No, it's not RFID. Here's the guy, okay. we've got Jordan's massive sticker, Steve Mine. The Secret Vault. Awesome. There it is. The Wall of Fame. Is that it then? I think so. That looks like a big um, oil hose, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Someone's just put so, some big spotlights on over there. Really? Yeah. What, by the entrance yeah, or? Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. This is how we do it. Yeah, swing it out before you get it near those nettles. Right. <laughs> I better hold that really well. Oh yeah, look, you can see it on the infrared. The just mark. Yeah. Just permeating. <laughs> <laughs> This is why you need dual ladders, folks. Oh, you got that one, Steve? Yeah. Yep. Whoa. Cheers, mate. Mm. Thank you. Prove that we have actually Sorry. finally uh, done it. This has been on the cards for about 20 years. What did it come out here? Yeah? You ready for the ladder, boys? Got him? Yep. And that's how you do it. You right, hold on. Fellas. What? Top one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you said there was somebody coming in. Like, what, 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 what? Alright. Well done. 
watch anybody fancy a bit of um, strenuous behaviour? You're, you're young, Jordan. Come on, you 20 year old bastard. Good man. <laughs> oh, thanks for coming, guys. <laughs> I hope we're 20 forever. I'm really glad you got to see that. They just didn't like the because it said the word military and they thought, oh. Yeah. So we're the first then. We are the first. That was awesome, yeah. mate. We have seen it here. <laughs> mm. So, yeah, guys. That has been an awesome bunker. I really hope you enjoyed that one. Props to Matt for showing us this place. Uh, thanks for Jordan. Thanks to Steve exploring within. If you enjoyed that one, uh, please leave a like. Leave us a comment in the comment section. I'll get back to you. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. It just means you get our next video. So, yeah, we'll catch you in the next one, guys.